What's up guys, Blaze here, and welcome to the first episode of Beyond Cribs. I'm going to be showing off my setup today, um, so I hope you enjoy. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to uh, scooch on over here to the doorway. Uh, sweet swinging transition. Well, and uh, kind of show what it looks like from over here to start off with. And, uh, yeah, so, got my, my double bed when the magic happens. Mm-hmm. No, I'm saying. Uh, some clothes, my wardrobe, windowsill, picture and some hats and stuff. Um, my gaming, well it's not really a gaming chair, it's an office chair, but it's a pretty badass chair. Yeah, really comfortable. Makes gaming a much more fun experience, you know what I'm saying? And uh, yes, I'm going to sit down in it and uh, show off my stuff. So let you uh, have a look. So here we've got the 250 gig uh, Xbox Slim. The razor sticker on it because razor stickers are badass. Um, I've got the uh, wireless connection adapter because the built in one sucks. Um, for anybody who is considering getting this or who already has this, you're bet much better off with using that if you don't already. Um, it's just boosts you, like, literally it doubles the uh, connection you get through it. I'm not, not like exaggerating at all here. Like, I was getting strict and moderate and that type, and that, like, all the time before I put that back in now get moderate slash um, open most of the time which is handy um, especially considering um, well since we moved house um, if you didn't know we moved house that's why I'm in this awesome bigger room now and uh, so basically since we've moved house my connection's not been as good uh, my ping's been better I get a 12 or 13 ping most of the time but my download speed is anywhere between 8 and like 14 and we should be getting about 25 um, well, we were getting 25 at the old house, and my upload speed is alright, usually between 5 and 8, which is pretty much what we were getting, like, we used to be getting, so, that's fine, that's all good, but, uh, yeah, here we have, um, Samsung, it's a TV screen, um, I wish I had another monitor, HDMI monitor, but at the minute I can't really afford to, so, unfortunately, well, not unfortunately, it's a good TV, so, I'll be sticking with this for, for now, and it does have HDMI, but I play on component 720p at the minute, because I record with a... Cloth Park HD PVR, the original one, uh, which doesn't have a HDMI input slash output, which is unfortunate, but whatever. Um, got an Acer, I think both screens are 22 inch computer monitor. This is a DVI input and uh, whatever the other one is, only it doesn't have HDMI, unfortunately, otherwise, I will be playing on that, not that, because that also has a DVI slash whatever input. Um, so I could be using that as a PC monitor if I had HDMI, but unfortunately, it does not. Um, so yeah, I've got two Logitech speakers, really good speakers actually. Um, I think got them from Argos a little while ago. Can't remember exactly how much they were, maybe like 20, 25 quid or something. Not bad. Uh, razor sticker again. And the razor stickers came off of the uh, razor death adder. I think it is the uh, death adder. Yeah. Focus, please, please. There we go. Here's a death adder, um, mouse, really good mouse, really good mouse mount, the Vespula. Um, would recommend both of them for any PC gamers or anybody who uh, just likes to have good a good mouse and mouse mount, I guess. Um, not much more else to say about that. Uh, moving over here, my headset, my PC headset, it's a uh, Creative Labs uh, Sound Blaster Wrath Tactic 3D. Um, really comfortable headset, I do. I did actually uh, snap that, unfortunately, so it's got some tape around it, some super glue inside. But, uh, which firstly, now oh, that was my fault, not the design fault. It is actually a bit of a tank headset, just because whenever I was putting it on, I was using, holding it like that and stretching it, and then eventually it snapped rather than holding it by that. But that was all down to my fault. Uh, some headphones are from college and got uh, my Volcom wallet, uh, pretty badass wallet. Really like this. Got it for my birthday last year. Um, looks pretty sweet, must say. Uh, some some uh, cinema view, cinema discounts. Uh, yeah, they're pretty badass. Um, uh, ever want to go watch a film or whatever, you know what I'm saying? Um, over here we have my massive wires, my uh, my tower. Um, this is really good to have. Uh, makes it a lot easier to have everything plugged in rather than having the uh, normal four four socket um, extension. Uh, it has, I think, as four down each side, then two on either side. So uh, ten ten plug sockets, which is awesome. It has a uh, button on top. I don't really know what it means. What it does, 
It doesn't actually seem to do much when I click between that and that. I don't I don't mess with that. I don't really understand it. I never asked. <laughs> but yeah. Um air filter for my hay fever when it's really bad because I really suffer from hay fever quite badly in summer. So yeah, that um helps to filter the pollen out of my room and that's all really sweet. Um down here got a normal wired Xbox 360 controller with my uh, uh original Control Freaks, the original design Control Freaks. I might be getting some, uh, oh, I can't remember what they're called, the uh, blue ones, the blue Halo with FPS ones. I can't remember what they're called, but I really like the look of them. I really, really like, think that um, because these are actually the uh, bit on top, the plastic on top is actually tearing. I don't know if you can see under there, but that's tearing off, unfortunately, which means I'm going to have to get a new pair at some point. So I might be doing soon while I've got a bit of money. Um, in here, I've just got the controllers, some old school candies which I don't use anymore because they're broken. Uh, um, down here that was like headphones, phone box, an extra case for my phone, stuff like that, some uh, documents and cards and whatever. Um, here we have my 360 headset, the uh, Razer Carcharius, the only uh, Xbox, actually Xbox compatible headset they made, I'm pretty sure. Um, it's a really good headset. I was thinking about getting the Kraken and then getting a mix out, but that was too expensive at the time, and so I might do that in future, but for now this is going to serve me well. They're a really good headset, um, really, really good. Um, as you can see, you have the, uh, the remote control here with voice, uh, game volume, bass, mute, all that good stuff on here. Really quite handy, really good headset, really good sound quality you get from it. Um, here we have my... Um, Sorry, my keyboard, it's TT Sports, I'm not sure exactly what keyboard, what, like the name of the keyboard is, but it's a really good keyboard, um, has a, has a um, removable fan which you can put either there or you can put it there underneath that little cap, um, lots of remappable buttons and stuff like that on the sides, um, so you get three, you get three sets of ten um, key, key remap things, I can't remember what they're called for life of me now, but yeah, um, really good keyboard, really good size, um, it's comfortable to, whenever I'm PC gaming, which I don't do that much anymore, but it is really comfortable. Uh, original HD PVR1, Hop Arg, um, really handy piece of kit, I might be getting a, either HD PVR2 or a El Gato, I'm not sure which, uh, but I will be selling that, um, hopefully get like 60 quid, 70 quid or so on eBay because I've seen them going for that, and so why not? Uh, pavilion PC, um, eight gigabyte RAM, one terabyte um, hard drive. It's an i3 processor, I'm pretty sure. So it does me the, it does the job that I want it to do, which is awesome. Um, really help, really handy for what I do because I do a lot of uh, recording and editing and stuff like that. And yeah, so it's really helpful, especially when I start live streaming, which I should be able to do soon. We have. YouTube live stream and we also have a Twitch TV channel so that should be cool uh, whenever I can sort that out if I get expert or whatever um, yeah so moving around here we have my cable leading up to dun dun dun, my uh, blue snowball on a I think it's a one meter mic stand uh, that's really helpful so whenever I'm recording live commentaries listening stuff like that I can uh, just have it all set up like that. I'd have that moved over so it's like next to my face. And yeah, so that's basically my setup. Um, I've got Skyrim poster, Skyrim world map thing here. I'll just move this over and show you my games and stuff real quick. Then, yeah, so over here, I've got a few PC games Doom, uh, Doom 3 BFG edition with Doom 1 and 2 and the extra missions. Um, COD 4, Oblivion, and Dark Messiah of Might and Magic. I don't really play PC games that much, though. Whenever I do, I'll probably be playing Oblivion or Doom, um, or whatever I've got on my Steam. Um, all the Call of Duties from Call of Duty 3 onwards. Um, Halo, Reach, and Halo 4. My girlfriend currently has my, my um, Halo 3, so that's why it's not there. Gears War 1 and 3. I sold 2 a while ago to get 3, so that's why I don't have that. Um, Rainbow Six Vegas 2, best first person shooter I've ever played. Um, hopefully Patriots, which is coming out this year, or should be coming out this year, will be really good. Um, I will probably be playing that if it's in the competitive scene, if it's um, if it's in EGL or MLG or whatever. I will be playing that competitively, back on GB's, Dissert or whatever. Whatever accepts it, basically. Um, Dead Island, Witcher 2, Assassin of Kings. Um, that 
that game that I think is Fallout New Vegas, um, Time Shift, Rage, Borderlands 2, Skate, and Left 4 Dead 2. Uh, down here, got some books, Darren Shan, all the Darren Shan, well, not all the Darren Shan books, but a lot of Darren Shan books. Um, some of them are in different places or whatever. Um, and then we have, oops, sorry. Yeah, they have my films, uh, From Russia With Love, my favourite James Bond film, Shaun of the Dead, my favourite film, the Pokemon film, I can't see what that is, um, I think it's Heroes, the movie, Scooby-Doo 2, the movie, uh, Dark Knight Rises, no, just The Dark Knight, Saving Private Ryan, my other favourite film, uh, Ace Ventura, Pet Detective, Toy Story 3, Simpsons, all six Star Wars movies, um, Pirates of the Caribbean 1, Garfield 1 and 2, Ghostbusters 1 and 2, Lee Mack going out live, um, and not, Lee Mack not going out seasons 1, 2 and 3, um, Lee Mack's my favourite um, comedian, so that's why I've got all them, and then three CDs down here, um, I don't know if this is going to focus, but two a day to remember, CDs, well, al albums, and Imagine Dragons album, um, two of my favourite bands, so yeah. Uh, but that's pretty much it for this, uh, let me just move everything back and sit down. But uh, yeah, that's pretty much it for this uh, for this episode. Um, hopefully, Joss, Harry, and Sam will be doing episodes of their own at some point soon. But uh, hope you enjoy. Leave a like, favorite, comment, all that good stuff. Retweet on Twitter, all that. And uh, yeah, have a good one, guys. And I'll see you all later. Bye.